All right. As always, I am going to read each of our questions to you and then the story. First up is the vocabulary. Now, I know the direction say, which has the same meaning as the bolded word. In this case, I can't bold anything on Google Forms. So it is the word that is in all capital letters, which has the same meaning as the bolded word. The snake lived in a forest habitat. So which word means the same as habitat? Whole, home, building, or ranch? He had noticed a solitary tree ahead of him. Angry, hunting, scary, or single. The number of mice multiplied, lessened, increased, disappeared, stayed the same. The farmer eliminated all the weeds in the pumpkin patch. Saw, found, removed, or looked for. Which phrase is a synonym for reintroduced in the sentence below? The gray wolf was reintroduced to the ecosystem. Taken out of, seen often in, never seen in, brought back to. Again, what is the same thing as reintroduced? <clears throat> All right. Now, we practiced our C or our V, C, E words. Remember that magic E or that silent E makes the second vowel in the word long. So what is the long vowel in the word dislike? Mistake. Tadpole, amuse, complete, snake, describe. All right, and then we have a short reading passage, two of them. I will read the first one and the second one and then go over the questions. Do zoos add to a community? There are those who would say no, but in fact, zoos are helpful for animals, especially those that are endangered or in danger of disappearing forever. Zoos can help protect them and keep them safe. Early zoos were often nothing more than cement cages with bars. But today, more and more zoos are working to create areas that look very much like an animal's habitat in nature. Workers at zoos want to help animals. If an animal becomes hurt or sick, zoos have special doctors to help them get better. Zoos make it possible for animals to raise their young in a safe place. This helps animals that are endangered as they struggle to survive. No to zoos. For years, most people did not really stop to think about the ways zoos affect animals. It's true that zoos give people a place to learn about animals, but more and more people are questioning the idea of putting animals in zoos. No matter how hard zoos work to make a zoo habitat similar to a natural habitat, they cannot succeed completely. This is because in many cases, the needs of animals cannot be met. For example, elephants and giraffes in the wild travel and run great distances. They cannot do that in a zoo. One reason people say zoos are needed is because they can help animals that are in danger of disappearing, but some animals simply do not do well in a zoo. Putting those animals in zoos is not fair. Even though zoos want to help animals, there are too many problems. It is time for zoos to close. So which sentence from the first selection explains a claim or main argument from yes to zoos? You're going to have to go back to that story or the text. Which statement from no to zoos contains a fact about the topic? The two selections agree about the idea that. And finally, based on the selections, explain two different opinions that people have about zoos. So you need to tell me the opinion of each. You guys have got this. I've been so pleased with your work this week. Take your time. Check your work. See you later.